<coughs> Welcome back. This is the uh, last part I'm going to be able to do tonight anyway. Talk to... What the hell? Katja. <laughs> hey there, girls. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? <laughs> I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay Damn like it. this. No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. Well, that's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just... Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then I can't take away the things we... the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Anybody in their right mind would. Families and barbecues and beers with good friends. All of those things. Those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Oh, God. Just forgotten how bloody... Kenny. <laughs> hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Nah, nah, no, no kids. Would have liked one then. You know. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But... We're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. Yeah. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. See ya. Hmm. Oh, so he's got a boat, okay. Uh... So I kind of like the quality of the, the quality of this. Can can you not run or is it? You can't even run. Oh dear. How you doing, Duck? Good. I'm going to drive the tractor. <laughs> I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. You had to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> Sean's still working on that fence. Do you, uh, think this thing will keep him out? Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. If you will. Uh, 
Which way do I... Do I even... I don't know what... I don't even know what I bloody do. Can you go inside... Can we go inside Herschel's house? No, I didn't think so. What, we're back here again? Ah. Um. I'm stuck. So talk to her. Hey, back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Uh, oh, hello. Ah, there we go. You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Oh, right. How are these things to drive? Awesome! Pain in the ass, mostly. Big, heavy as hell, and slower than, uh... Your mother. Well... Sean's still working on that fence. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bytes to length, that sure speed things up. Ah, there we go. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Damn. Oh shit, damn. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned. Put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes and pull the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh, uh... Yeah, twice. I had to shoot one. I could shoot one. Maybe. If it were far away. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? Um, not too close to my family. Damn, pressed the wrong uh, one. Well, they weren't in Atlanta, right? So that's good. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Ah, uh, he's gone into the barn anyway. Okay. <clears throat> Slowly getting through this. Oh, bloody hell. Talk to Herschel, who looks nothing like he does in the, in the film. And not in the film, the TV show. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. <laughs> Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? No wife. Uh, not anymore. I uh, think she's up in Virginia, maybe. Sorry to hear it. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? 
Yeah. I was looking for help in her house. Yeah. Pretty much. Hmm. Can I so, give you a piece of advice? So not much. Um Sure. You know, comment I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. Well, at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Go! I'll get my gun! What's happening? <laughs> If I if I saved him, not the, not the boy. Get out! Get the fuck out of here! Wow. I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. And you, you didn't even try to help. I panicked. Look at him. Remember that next time you panic. Please. Just go. Get out and never come back. Rock and hard place. Achievement unlocked. Lol. And my frame rate's gone right down. Why is my frame rate gone down to 20 frames a second? You've got that ride to make it if you want it. Ah, uh, that's better. Let's go back up. There might be a different story if I save. This is as far as we're going. And it's far enough. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Trucks run out of gas. No. No. Fuck! Yeah, the zombies. shut no matter what I fucking mean it <laughs> we don't know who these people are they could be dangerous worse they could have let them right to us we have kids with us I see one little girl what is it 
I... I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. She's the leader here. But it looks like she's losing control of her people. If you were in my shoes, you'd be the... Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Uh, over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It's... Lily, I'll handle it. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here. And none of this will fucking matter. He needs right to now, calm down. We're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. What if this was your daughter? Never would have happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Fuck you and her. <clears throat> I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Key's behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch! She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, when she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. It's a little boy. I think we can handle him. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now! Knock this guy out. Happily. Oh, Jesus! Oh, oh man. Ah! Ah! Jesus! Ah! Come ah! Ah! Zombie. Ah! Oh, God, he's... Oh, God. 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 Oh, Damn. Loads of crap is happening this, this you okay? part, isn't it? Isn't it? Uh, Just great, thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, guys? My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? 
We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. <laughs> Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. Okay. All right. Silence is consent. Oh, That's the plan. Bloody. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get it. Please scroll spot. well. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. What, well, he's, he's took bloody charge already? Uh, energy bar. I don't, don't know if I'll need it, but... Mm. Anything happened to Ducky? I know, hon. Hmm. I don't remember them very well. Hey, Lee. Maybe punching him wasn't such a good idea. There were worse plans. Says the guy who didn't get punched in the mouth. <laughs> anyway, we, Cat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No mm. kidding. How's she doing? Well, her family's dead, so... That's awful, Lee. Yeah, well... She seems to be handling herself all right. She's just a little girl, Ken. Lee says she spent days on her own. That takes toughness. Yeah. But you have no idea what sort of emotional damage is happening to her every second her family is gone. <laughs> what's, the, what's the plan? Yeah. Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? They, uh, own this place. They're... gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but... yeah, they did. Yeah. Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. Lee, you got a second hand treatment? Sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves over We him. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happened. We didn't make a choice to kill John. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Try to let it go. He will remember my loyalty again. <clears throat> we just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. Right. I'll do our damnedest. Can I? Uh, let's take another 
energy bar. There's, there's quite a few people uh, I'm going to have to... Uh, I'm not sure how many parts this... It's not damaged. Each yeah, this episode didn't get looted. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. <laughs> what are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here, let me have a look. Batteries in this thing. What now? There's no batteries in it. You know that there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. <sighs> Useless. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. Mm. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't tell. My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me, and I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, <laughs> you know. Yeah. What can you do, eh? <laughs> that guy saved you? Yeah. Can you believe it? Those creeps, or, or ghouls, or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling Zombies. our van apart, and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kinda cute. In that parents' basement sort of way. Huh? Huh? Oh, nothing. <laughs> I'm still looking for batteries for that day. Thanks. I appreciate it. How'd you end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. Sounds worth it. I better get back to it. Yep. <coughs> Let's talk to you. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out <laughs> there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Not right now. All right, let me know if you want to. Let's just talk to the other two people then. And the uh, yeah, and the video is pressing on half an hour, another half hour. Oh, hello. Try to get some rest, Humphrey. How can I with those things out there? That was one battery. There should be another. So if I found one, there should be another. It's all melted now. <laughs> right, come on. No, I don't want to go in there yet, do we? Talk How's to you. it doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I know that. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again, and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. Why is my frame rate gone down again? He's got a temper. Ah, fuck you! <laughs> yeah, he doesn't mean it. It's just that... Yeah? We've got kids here. Families. He and I are a family. I'm just saying some people can't handle a temper like that. Hell, that it seems like you can. It's just his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. Where's her mom? 
Savannah, I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found her in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. Yeah. You're from here? I Sometimes. work at Warner Robins, the Air Force base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with <laughs> a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? Mm -hmm. I work up at UGA. Yeah, okay. Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. Good thing to do. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, more Jesus. Them. We need to stick together and get through this. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Right. There's one more person I need to talk to, but there's got to be another battery somewhere. Ah. Let's talk to you again. Hey there. Hi. Any word from Glenn? Nothing. Is he okay? Yeah, I think so. You're doing a good job. Can I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. I'll see about that. So, um... Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh... I'm good. That's good. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Uh, being good is good, despite the circumstances. Yep. State the obvious. We'll sit tight. Okay. Well, I've spoke to everyone. Oh, well, yeah, you're using the one hour keys to move. That's terrible. Okay. That's that's um all I'm, that's all I'm gonna do for now. Let's just Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. <laughs> okay. I'm going to end the video here. Then next video we'll start by fixing the radio. Thanks for watching it this part, guys. Mm, yeah, you know, you know that. Yeah. Hope you enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.